Welcome back into Good Morning Maryland. This morning, crews are still trying to figure out what caused a fire that destroyed part of the Edmondson Village Shopping Center over the weekend. It's the second massive fire there in less than a year and a half. We have WMR2 News Aaron McPherson live at the Shopping Center with a look at some of the damage this morning. Aaron, what can you tell us? Well, we know no one was hurt in this fire, but there are a handful of businesses that are closed because of the damage they have right now. They are boarded up. You can see those boards on the windows and the doors from these five units condemned, one of them up for lease, the other four active businesses, the pharmacy, Edmondson Pharmacy, then there's the Fashion Town, Jackson Hewitt, and Family Dollar. And people who live in this area say they rely on this shopping center to get their medicine and low cost items. The fire started just before 10 o'clock on Saturday night, and it took nearly 100 firefighters five hours to get it under control. It's a very old building um, and over the years we've pushed the owner to invest in the property. Um, we'll continue to have those conversations. Hopefully they figure out what happened and um, they can kind of come to an agreement to maybe restore the whole shopping center because that's what it, that's what we all need at this, this certain location. In November of 2019, the west end of this shopping center was destroyed by a fire. The fire department never determined a cause. Councilman Burnett says it's because a broken gas line kept the fire going and it created too much damage for any evidence. All right, now crews are still trying to figure out what caused this fire. The city fire marshal is investigating as well as a private team hired by the property owner. Reporting live here from Edmondson Village Shopping Center, Aaron McPherson, WMAR 2 News.